Hello and welcome to the session. Let's work out the following problem. It says a particle moving in a straight line with uniform acceleration describes successive equal distances in times t1, t2 and t3. Prove that 1 upon t1 minus 1 upon t2 plus 1 upon t3 is equal to 3 upon t1 plus t2 plus t3. So let's now move on to the solution. We are given that a particle moving in a straight line describes the equal distances in time t1, t2 and t3. So let AB is equal to BC is equal to CD is equal to S be the three equal distances. And let u be the initial velocity at A. Then f meter per second square is the a uniform acceleration now we have ab is equal to bc is equal to cd is equal to s the particle is moving in a straight line describing equal distances in times t1 t2 and t3 now the particle describes the distance AB is equal to S in time T1 right similarly it describes distance AC that is this which is equal to S plus S that is 2S in time T1 plus T2 since we are given that the particle describes the equal distances in time T1, T2 and T3 so it if it describes the distance S in time T1 so it describes the distance to S in time T1 plus T2 and also the distance AD that is equal to 3S in time T1 plus T2 plus T3, right? Now the distance travelled S is given by the formula UT plus 1 by 2 FT square. S is the distance travelled. U is the initial velocity. And F is the acceleration. You must remember this formula and write it while using this. Now the distance AB is S is given by UT1. T is the time taken plus 1 by 2 FT1 square. Since the time taken to describe the distance S is T1, so here we have used T1 and similarly distance AC that is 2S is equal to U into T1 plus T2. Since the time taken to describe the distance AC that is 2S is T1 plus T2. 
and here we have 1 by 2 into f into t1 plus t2 whole square and ad that is 3s is equal to u into t1 plus t2 plus t3 since the time taken to describe the distance 3s is t1 plus t2 plus t3 to 1 by 2 t1 plus t2 plus t3 whole square. Let's name this as 1, this as 2 and this as 3. Now subtract One from two and two from three, we have subtracting one from two, we have two s minus s is equal to u into T1 plus T2 plus 1 by 2 F into T1 plus T2 whole square minus UT1 plus 1 by 2 FT1 square. So 2S minus S is equal to UT1 plus UT2 plus 1 by 2 f into t1 square plus t2 square plus 2 into t1 t2 applying the formula of a plus b whole square minus u t1 minus 1 by 2 f t1 square. So this is equal to u t1 gets cancelled with u t1 1 by 2 f t1 square will get cancelled with minus 1 by 2 f t1 square. We are left with u t2 plus 1 by 2 f t2 square plus 1 by 2 gets cancelled with 2 here. And we have f t1 into t2. So this is equal to u t2 plus 1 by 2 f into t2 square plus t1 t2. Now we subtract 2 from 3. So we have 3s minus 2s is equal to 3 is u into t1 plus t2 plus t3 that is u t1 plus u t2 plus u t3 plus 1 by 2 f into t1 plus t2 plus t3 whole square minus ac that is 2 s was equal to u into t1 plus t2 that is u t1 plus u t2 plus 1 by 2 f into t1 plus t2 whole square. Now this is equal to u t1 plus u t2 plus u t3 plus 1 by 2 f into t1 square plus t2 square plus t3 square plus 2 t1 t2 plus 2 t2 t3 plus 2 t3 t1 minus now since we have negative sign of outside the bracket when we will open the bracket sign will change so this becomes minus u t1 minus u t2 minus 1 by 2 f into t1 plus t2 whole square is t1 square plus t2 square plus 2 into t1 t2. 
So again we have ut1 plus ut2 plus ut3 plus 1 by 2f t1 square. So we have opened the bracket. Now ut1 gets cancelled with minus ut1. ut2 gets cancelled with minus ut2. 1 by 2 f t1 square gets cancelled with minus 1 by 2 f t1 square. And we are left with ut3 plus 1 by 2 f t3 square plus f t2 t3 plus f t3 t1. Now this can be written as ut2 plus 1 by 2 into f taking t2 common. We have 1 by 2 f t2 into t2 plus 2 t1. Let's name this as a. And this can be written as ut3 plus 1 by 2 Taking 1 by 2 f common, we have t3 square plus 2 t2 t3 plus 2 t3 t1. This is again equal to ut3 plus 1 by 2 f taking t3 common. We have t3 plus 2 t2 plus 2t1. Now here also 3s minus 2s is s. So s is equal to this and let's name this as b. Now from a and b we have S is equal to, from A we have S is equal to UT2 plus 1 by 2 F T2 into T2 plus 2 T1 and from B we have S is equal to UT3 plus 1 by 2 F T3 into T3 plus 2 T2 plus 2 T1. Now, here, dividing both sides by T2, we have S by T2 is equal to U plus 1 by 2 F into T2 plus T1. And here, dividing both sides by T3, we have S upon T3 is equal to u plus 1 by 2 f into t3 plus 2 t2 plus 2 t1. Let's name this as 4 and this as 5 and also from 1 we have s is equal to ut1 square plus 1 by 2 f t1 square now dividing both sides by t1 we have s t1 is equal to u here we have u t1 so here we have u plus 1 by 2 f t1 let's name this as 6 now we have to prove that 1 upon t1 minus 1 upon t2 plus 1 upon t3 is equal to 3 upon t1 plus t2 plus t3. This is what we have to prove. So now we find s upon t1 minus s upon t2 plus s upon t3. So we have s upon t1 is u plus 1 by 2 f t1 minus s upon t2 which is this. So this is u plus 1 by 2 into 
एफ इन टू टी टू प्लस टू टी वन प्लस एस अपॉन टी थ्री विच इज दिस दिस इज यू प्लस वन बाय टू एफ इन टू टी थ्री प्लस टू टी टू प्लस टू टी वन राइट नाउ वी हैव S upon T1 minus S upon T2 plus S upon T3 is equal to U plus 1 by 2 F T1 minus U minus 1 by 2 F into T2 plus 2 T1 plus U plus 1 by 2 F into T3 plus Two T two plus two T one. Now U gets cancelled with U, and we have U plus in all these terms taking one by two F common. So we have one by two into F into T one minus of. T two plus two T one plus T three plus two T two plus two T one. This is equal to U plus one by two F into T one minus T two minus two T one plus T three plus two T two plus two T one. So this is equal to u plus one by two into f. Now minus two t one gets cancelled with plus t two t one, and we have t one two t two minus t two is plus t two plus t three. So this is equal to Three s upon t one plus t two plus t three because we had a d which is equal to three s is equal to u into t one plus t two plus t three plus one by two f into t one plus t two plus t three square. So this implies dividing both sides by t1 plus t2 plus t3, we have 3s upon t1 plus t2 plus t3 is equal to u plus 1 by 2 into f into t1 plus t2 plus t3. So here we have substituted. This by 3s upon t1 plus t2 plus t3. So we have s upon t1 minus s upon t2 plus s upon t3 is equal to 3s upon t1 plus t2 plus t3. Now taking s common from here and cancelling on both sides, we have. One upon t1 minus one upon t2 plus one upon t3 is equal to three upon t1 plus t2 plus t3, and this is what we have to prove. So this completes the question and the session. Bye for now. Take care. Have a good day.